I am increasingly feeling like the medical profession really doesn't care as much as it should about women and mothers because we have yet another scandal involving um, sort of medication being given to mothers, which has been shown to cause disabilities. I mean, we thought this would end with thalidomide. Um, I am actually shocked that they are still at times using the sodium valparate. Um, I haven't actually in my practice used it perhaps I would say for about 20 years, 15, 20 years, because they are now using Kepra, which is the um, alternative to sodium valparate. Uh, but I have had one patient who that was uh, 31 and a half years ago, who was on sodium valparate and that child has got the fetal valparate syndrome, unfortunately. Mm. But mm. they are now on Kepra, in my experience, all the ladies are on Kepra, but of course, the GPs and their maternity services have got to be aware that any woman of childbearing age should not be on sodium valparate. Mm, okay. So, uh, of course, if somebody was on sodium valparate and mm. they suddenly do, do become unexpectedly pregnant. And what, what exactly does that drug or medication do? What's its purpose originally? It's anticonvulsant, so okay. it's used for patients with, or, or ladies or anybody with epilepsy. Okay. Um, but at, at one point, they decided that if you were on a certain dosage, they should have, which it was a high dose of one gram in the day, they should have just split it so it was in the regular intervals. But now they do use Kepra mm. instead. Mm. Okay. And so what should women do? So say if somebody, somebody's pregnant now and they see these sorts of stories, they see that so many maternity wards are rated inadequate or requires improvement, they see scandals like this still emerging, they see um, child deaths, are unnecessary inquiries into sort of unnecessary child deaths and disabilities and things like that. And there'll be a lot of mothers who are worried and almost feel reluctant to go and see a doctor or reluctant to perhaps go on certain medication. What would be your advice? advice for those people? My advice for any lady who, number one, who is epileptic, if they are on sodium valparate, to go back to their GP and to make sure that they take them off sodium valparate. So if they are, the guidance is if they are of childbearing age, they should not be on sodium valparate. Okay. If they do suddenly find that they are pregnant, is an unplanned pregnancy, can they please discuss it with their obstetrician, midwife or GP immediately so they can then put them under robust and yeah. natal care to be mm. uh, to be um, monitored.